Hey everybody, it's Eva with Budget Your Life and today is Mini Mondays, Monday full of minis. I'm doing a voiceover because I did batch recording and only one of my three videos had sound. Um, ooh, shiny things. I guess I'm tapping that because I remembered to put it on. I'm very excited. I set it right here so I'd see it. There's a lot of things. I recorded this yesterday and I have absolutely no idea what I talked about, but there's a lot more hand gestures like we talked about last time. Um, very proud that I remembered to put that on. So I keep touching it and put it away. Great. So hello, everybody. Um, today is Monday full of minis. And I have the box here <laughs> that I have all my minis in. And uh, oh, and I'm put saying on there on my website, I have three of those boxes available. And where I pointed my finger, it says on there in black vinyl, Monday full of minis. And then I am working with this money. I pulled it out of my savings challenge binder. Uh, putting that away. We're good. Done with that one. Um, I look like I have some big bills there. I do remember this now. So this is um, Monday full of minis. So I had some tens and fives that I was hoping to condense or not condense, but like exchange out. Oh, new calculator, bringing it back in. Um, a couple people had some great uh, names for it. One of them was Ada. And then we could say Ada girl. <laughs> that made me laugh. And then um, just uh, big cuteness just came into the so I have $30 in tens, one five, and one, two, three, four, five ones. So nice and neat. Push that back, shut that, pull it forward, move the box. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I have so much pressure because you guys enjoyed the last one. And now I'm like struggling to remember what I said. I'm deciding to use the Tina, even though she likes to get stuck inside the um, mug. Uh, dice tower that I do have linked below and I'm setting my Coke Zero in there and getting a Tina prepped. Okay, so box comes back out. Okay, so here we go. I think we're going to start. I just touch everything a lot. Okay, so I'm opening the box. Oh, yeah, there I am opening the box. And then I think I'm saying I had a a challenge in there when I finished last week, one of mine that I put in. Um, but I decided that I wanted to go with this Saving with Sam. I'll have her linked below. She is a newer channel. She is killing it. She's doing so well. So if you have not heard of her, I would love for you to go over to her channel and check her out. And she has these freebies. These are freebies on her site. They're so cute. They have birthday ones. I think that's what I'm saying now in the video. So I'm actually, I think I'm doing okay. They have Earth Day ones, and then she has another one that I might pull out in a second that has something to do with soda. Like, oh my gosh, I can't remember what it says. Like, you're, I hope I'm, okay, I am getting it right now. I thought I did. And it's really cute. And uh, when I saw that, I saw that first before I saw her Earth Day. There it is. So it's soda much savings. <laughs> I think she really likes Diet Pepsi, I think, and uh, Coke Zero Girl through and through. Or Dr. Pepper, but again, we've talked about that. Dr. Pepper is life, as is Coke Zero, but... Um, so yeah, so I'm going to use uh, the Earth Day Challenge. Uh, I made each little circle a dollar, and I don't know what I'm talking about, but it might be Earth Day weekend. Maybe I'm saying that. And if it is, um, happy Earth Day, everybody. So I put it back in instead of taking it out. So I'm not sure. I think I'm starting to do Monday full of minis, but up oh, there I go maybe. And I'm sure I have to move stuff around because that's what I do all the time is just move things around. Oh, yep, there it goes. <laughs> I think it's physically, oh, just, yeah, what am I doing? I think it's physically impossible for me to actually, like, sit down and have everything ready to go and just start, oh, we're counting already. Okay, so um, the Let's Avocado, so that's the Hey K Budgets. Uh, that had a lot of money from last time. So I was able to get 10 ones for a $10 bill. So that helped a little bit. And then the next one is the Indy 500 challenge from budgeting for me. That didn't have too much. And then this is my GP's odds and ends. I think that's a freebie on her site, if I'm not mistaken. I feel like it's for April. 
that didn't have enough. And then my Nobby's Cash Life, that didn't have enough. But my little zombie one from Spooky Budgets looks like that has some. So I count out 10 bucks and grab the 10. And then I think I also count out five. Yep. And grab the five. So we leave a 10 in there, but that's 20 ones or 30 ones and a $10 bill. So I felt pretty confident that I'd be able to exchange those out um, at the end of or during the game. So, oh, moving things around again. Yeah, I think that gets moved again. Don't worry. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's see. GPs, oh, that's spooky budget. So I'm holding. I'm sure I'll talk about it through while I'm doing it, but um, let's see. GPs, odds and ends. Cowgirl sunset is top left. Taking a little drink break for Coke Zero. And then Nabby's Cash Life is second. And then Spooky Budgets, her little zombies. I did buy that, so that is not a freebie. But Nabby's Cash Life is a freebie. And then Hey K Budgets, Lats Avocado. I did purchase that, I believe. And then the Earth Day Challenge from Saving with Sam was free. And then I did buy the Indy 500 Challenge from Budgeting for Me. Look at me remembering stuff. See, I told you I'd move that again, so don't worry. So it's, I, you know touch things. Yep. I'm going to keep touching them all. I'm sure I'm touching something else. Pick up the money. Here we go. Okay. So the dice tower is a little frustrating and I think it's really with the, with the Tina dice, which is just the bedazzled dice because it gets stuck. I think it gets stuck on the little, I'm a little far away. I guess I should have been closer. Um, so that's five. So we've started that's one, uh, five again, four, and then just get used to hearing me say four, because that's going to keep happening, four. <laughs> um, hopefully I said in the original video that there is no sound. How's everybody doing? Uh, happy Monday, because this is Monday full of minis. Oh, I want this side of the board to get money because my little hand gesture meant that. And three, look at that, finally. So I hope everyone's doing well. I hope everyone had a great weekend. Um, I'm very excited because I did have my launch. Two gets $2, yay, Nebby's Cash Life. And four again. So I appreciate everyone who went to my website or liked a social post or just anything. I really appreciate it. Um, after I do this voiceover, I will probably be putting together some of the orders. I was going to video it, but some of it's um, like a mystery, like the mystery boxes. So I don't want others to see what's in that. So I'm going to kind of keep that a little bit of a mystery, but I might show a little clip or a little picture or something when oh, I was able to get that other 10 out. That's good. That little sound, if you heard it, meant somebody's on my website. Oh my God, that's so exciting. Thank you, whoever you are. Um, okay, so we're starting. We have, I think we're down to eight bucks, maybe six bucks now. Yay, six finally got something. And I just checked the film for Tiny Tuesdays because I did that one also and no sound. So the last $2 went to number one. Doing a little cleanup here. So you will get a voiceover two nights in a row because I can't re-record re those. I don't know what I'm saying about that dice tower, but it is linked below. Got it on Amazon. It's one of my favorite purchases, even if it's a little finicky with my Tina dice, which is just the bedazzled dice from Erica Black and Blue. Dripped by E, I think is the, the, the correct way to say that. And it's really hard because I edited the video in silence. And then now I'm trying to watch the video that I edited, which believe it or not, there was just a lot of space of hand gestures. And I was like, you know, what? we don't need all those hand gestures. So now I'm moving things around again because I want everything to be just right. I'm surprised I don't touch the dollars in the corner again because they're out of line. Okay, so we have GP's odds and ends. She's really close to a thousand. I think that's what I'm saying here. So if you haven't already checked out her channel, you should because, you know, she's super close to a thousand and I know that would make her day. 
And yeah, um, probably still saying that because I'm pointing at it emphatically. So, oh, I wanted to straight the money out first and then count it. So, but I only do it with this one. I don't do it with any of the other ones, I don't think. So I don't know why it was super important with the first one. I think we got $8. And on the bottom, there's two fours. So I'm going to get the big dollars. Big dollars. I'm going to get the fours out of the way. Because I don't, I usually have between 30 and 40 bucks to play with Monday full of minis. So, um, yeah, so we knocked out eight. So then that's the first rows, ones, and then twos, and then threes, and then fours. So it's a super pretty challenge. I, um, it's a freebie of hers, and then I just laminated it. Oh, I'm counting it. I think we have 10. Yeah, we have 10 in there. And I'm just showing you how pretty it is. And then it just goes in its home. It's a little box until next week. So this is Nabby's Cash Life. This was a freebie on her channel. <laughs> I think I called it something else. And so I was doing weird hand gestures. But um, so it got $2. Each little cat with sunglasses is $1. So I will color in two sets of sunglasses. Oh, I should have sped this up. But that's okay. There's only two. Well, technically, there's four circles two sunglasses. It's not that bad. When I try to make a joke on purpose, I can't, but um, yeah, so Nabby's adorable. If you haven't checked out her site or her YouTube channel, is that somebody else on my website? That's so funny. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm saying. Maybe it's a freebie and you should go check her out. And then Spooky Budgets. Oh, I'm trying to say how Nabby can count cash because I can't for the life of me figure it out every time. I should do it. I should have money in my hand when I'm watching her because then it might be easier for me to follow. But when I try to recreate it from memory, I can never do it. So we only had $2 left from Spooky Budgets. Ooh. Okay. So yay for finishing a challenge. And that was $2 from... My spooky budgets challenge and we saved I think 18. Oh I do switch it around for this one. Yep $18 in the adorable little zombie spooky budgets and that was uh, downloadable on her website. I just purchased that one. I did purchase something else but it said it wasn't going to be here until like early to mid-May which is fine. I cannot wait to grab it and use it. Oh my gosh, is there another person on my website? Sorry for all the sound effects. Okay, that's super fun. Okay. Um, okay, so, gosh, I'm still talking. I don't know what I'm saying. I think I'm saying I had to take money out of my I don't know what I'm saying. Throwing things around. Oh, it's one of my little new scratch offs that's on my website. And then I'm going to put it in my completed challenges envelope and then showing everybody how much I have for April so far, which is huge for me because I don't save money. I allocate money, I spend it. And then those are the ones I had to clear out for taxes. So I'm leaving them in there so I can just see how much I saved at the end of the month. Okay. So finished one so I'm picking a new one and there's so many one of my little new setup on my desk I have a um where I keep all my pens the bottom little drawer fits perfectly all of these um mini challenges so I just have a drawer full and it's like a couple inches deep it's not like a huge drawer and then so I decide to do the um race car from Mel's paper makes that she just emailed over to me. So I think if you are interested in it, you should go to her Etsy site and see if, A, see if it's on there, if she ever put it up there. And if not, message her and just tell her that you're interested and if she can put it on her Etsy shop. So I'm excited to start that one. So, hey, K budgets, we got a chunk. Let's see 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 bucks. That's a lot. So I just cross out 18. I won't go through it because I just counted. 
but it does leave the last little row for next time. So we are close to finishing that out. It's pretty fun. And then I count everything, which I already started talking through that. So it seems like a good amount. Uh, oh, I counted and I was, it was like a, off by a dollar. And I remembered I have that one little single, which I'll get uh, the next time. So yay, Saving with Sam, my little Earth Day challenge has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bucks. So I made each little circle a dollar and I'm just going to put in a little dollar in each one. And I don't like how my dollars are coming out, but I don't ever write my dollars that way. I usually write just a, like a line, but then it didn't look like a dollar. So I decided to write it that way. So I'm very excited about that. This is really nice. And I, it was her free on her, I don't know if she has a Google Drive, but if you go to her YouTube page and watch her videos and like her, she's really good. I then um, just laminated, laminated it myself. And then with the Indy 500, uh, challenge from budgeting for me. I had two dollars, so I'm gonna scratch off the car for one, and then I decide to scratch off ones I've already done before because I felt like you couldn't really see that I scratched them off. So I still have one more I need to actually scratch off, and I think I choose oh the little pit stop. Yeah, so a few more to go, but got two more to scratch off or check off or however you want to word it. So yay, that is Monday full of minis and cheers to you for watching. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate your support. So like, comment, subscribe and take care. Bye.